I want to come on and share with you a haul and yes it is a clothing haul honey and you know every year every season we change in we change out we change pieces and all that good old stuff so what I want to do was share with you some of the items that I have picked up recently to add to my wardrobe for the spring and the summer months I really am trying to transition myself into a capsule which I only select certain colors. However, some of these pieces I picked up before I decided to do that. So you're going to see some of the colors that are not in my color scheme. However, um, I'll let you know more about the color scheme as I decide exactly. I, I basically know the colors that I want, but keep in mind, you're going to see pieces that are not in that color scheme. So anyway, anywho, if you have not subbed yet, hit the sub button, hang out with your girl. I may do um a try on i'm really not sure yet if i don't do a try on i promise that i'm dedicating myself this year to doing more um outfits a day because you know i mean i am 40 plus almost 50 i'll be 49 this year if the lord let me live to see and i mean hey I just want to share my fashion with you, girl. That's all. But anyway, if you want to see what I got, stay tuned. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell if you want to, if you don't mind. All right. This is a Jones of New York shirt that I purchased from Marsh. I really like this shirt, how it's actually made. This is a great piece that I can wear now. Well, not now, y'all, because it is it was um it's 23 degrees outside tonight it was only 40 today it's only going to be 40 tomorrow so yeah I, I i can't wear this even up on the uh cardigan i can't wear this right now any adrian vitadini which y'all saw that i had the black shoes that were adrian vitadini um i love this shirt as well i'm really like getting into the snake skin y'all i don't know why your girl just really finding that i like Snake skin. You know how you just be like really into the leopard and stuff like that? Yeah. But snake skin has been like grabbing your girl attention lately. I don't know why, but it is. But how cute is this? I love this shirt, y'all. It is so flowy. It has buttons down to here. And I really like flowy shirts like this. I just feel like because I do have like a little stuff I'm working on, girl. Until I get there, I'm going to dress these curves. I'm not going to yeah we'll go into that later anyway i love this shirt right i like the detail in the hem for those of you that saw my fit stitch box and try on if you haven't check it out if you haven't looked at that video yet check it out but i really am getting to the point where i want to step outside my box you know out of the ordinary and i just thought we really cool to have somebody else design me for a few months so i am going to get stitch fix for a few months um because i really want them to take me out of my comfort zone y'all gonna see that these pieces here it's just what i know you know what i'm saying yes i know how to dress myself professionally business wise i struggle when it comes to casual dressing which is really what i really want to get into more um just cat you know having really cute casual pieces sometimes anyway i purchased this y'all i am so big into army fatigue and snake skin that's what i don't know why i can't even explain it girl but anyway i got this shirt here from tori if somebody does not keep your girl out of tori why y'all didn't tell me i went to the mall me and my granddaughter's both my grand, two of my granddaughters, because y'all know I got a few, and my daughter. And so this day I went in, y'all, because I was like, you know what, I'm buying better quality stuff. I just really am into that mode now where I really want to put a little bit more into my clothes and just buy better quality stuff. So I went in toward it, and I was like, you know what, let me just go check this out. About eight, nine, ten pair, about ten pair of jeans later. And a few shirts. And y'all know Taurus is not cheap. But it's all Gucci because I am almost 50. If I can't buy myself some, you know, quality jeans or some quality, there's something is Ryan doing something right. And I'm talking about this is for me, me and my house, y'all. It don't have nothing to do with y'all. I'm not trying to be bougie. I'm not trying to be none of that. It's just that, hey, it is a phase that I'm going through right now. So let me have my moment, okay? 
<laughs> Anywho, so I got this shirt for Tori. This one happened to be on sale for $25, but I wanted this shirt. How cute is this? And typically, I really, a lot of times, don't like buttons on my breasts because I got some big knobs. But, <laughs> no, girl, I'm serious, though. But I like this shirt. I really, really do. I like the army fatigue on it. I think it's just cute. So, and there is the back right there. Y'all see I got arm fatigue now. I just, I got this shirt from TJ Maxx um, about a couple months ago. But this shirt is so comfortable. It feels so good. And I got this one here that says, I run on sarcasm. I run on sarcasm. It's $21. And the thing is, is that if I could find a sale, then I find a sale, but Tori is my new store. Girl, I got to stay out that store. I, I I don't know. I might just do a whole video of jeans, but you know, jeans are kind of like jeans, even though I got different kinds of jeans. I might, because you know, I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. But anyway, I bought too many pairs of Tori jeans. So my shoes. But they did have a sale, buy three, buy two, get one free. So, three pair for about $180. Anyway, that's what I did. So, I got these two little blazers here, y'all. And I love these blazers. Love these because they are lightweight. Um, they have the pockets on the front, the sleeves. You know, they're real flowy. I can push the sleeves up, you know, if I get too warm or whatever. But I thought these would be cute too. Like, you know, even with a pair of jeans, you know what I'm saying? Like some boots right about now or something. I just thought these would be real cute. I'm really getting into blazers. It's a phase I'm going through. I don't know. I used to be a cardigan girl. I'm pretty much sick of cardigans right now. I just don't like cardigans no more. Do y'all ever go through these fashion phases? Like at one point, I love cardigans. I had a freak. I had so many cardigans. They used to laugh at me, y'all. They called me the cardigan queen, honey. But I don't like cardigans anymore. I don't know why. I don't like them. Um, <clears throat> so, I'm more into jackets and blazers and stuff like that right now. That could change by the end of the year. Who knows, girl? But I got this um, jacket here. Another Army Fatigue jacket that I got from Marshalls. This is actually by Sanctuary. And it was $30. But, um... <laughs> I like this. I think this would be cute with whatever. Y'all gonna see me with some crazy stuff because I'm into this mixing print kind of thingy. Y'all gonna be like, what the flip has she got on? What is she doing? Don't worry about it, girl. It's gonna be cute though. Trust me. I, I It's a phase I'm going through. It's a phase, I know. So, um, I picked up this little blazer here. This is from Soho. So, this is really inexpensive. This is only $17, but... Um, I liked it because it has the black and the white little checkers. I don't know if you can tell what it is, but yeah, that was really inexpensive. Then I got this um, jacket here from Marshalls, which is $30. This is Jules and Leo, is that Leo? Leopold or however you pronounce it, child. But how cute is this, right? It's got a little rouging on the sleeves. And I, this is, now I can tell y'all this color is definitely going to be in my capsule, the capsule that I'm building. But yeah, I love this jacket. It's so cute. Next up is this shirt by Style and Co. that I got from Macy's. And I purchased, I made a big order to Macy's. And anyway, Macy's, I use my Ebates. And I had like $190, girl, in, in Macy's. Um, in Ebates dollars. So if y'all want to use Ebates, let me tell you something, girl. Sign up for Ebates. My link is in the description bar below. You got to sign up for Ebates because you get cash back, honey. And I had $190. So it's real. I, so far, I've had, I have gotten $800, $800 and some change back in Ebates. So if you're going to shop, you might as well just sign up. Hit the, you know, look in the description bar below. Sign up. I'll get something. You'll get something. And, you know, you'll save some money. But this was from Macy's and it's Style Co. I love this shirt. It is so cute. Um, It's just cute. I don't normally go for shirts like this, but I want to, to me, this is a, a, a cute casual piece. 
that I could put together with something. Um, I want to say this shirt is blue and white, but it's Vince Camuto. Vince Camuto is one of the designers that I was telling y'all about that I really am feeling his pieces and I want to start to buy more pieces from Vince Camuto, but girl, he is expensive as crap, so I will have to find stuff on sale. I got this shirt from Macy's and yeah. Now, you ready for this? Girl, I love this shirt right here. Look at the fringe, honey. Look at the fringe. How cute is that? Can you see that? And this is a Vince Camuto shirt. And this is actually the back of the jack of the shirt. So the tie comes from the back into the front and hang down. But um, I just love these little fringes there. Next up, I got these two Tommy Hilfiger shirts. I don't normally wear a Tommy Hilfiger, but I liked these shirts. I thought they were really cute. This one has silver stars. It's actually black with the silver stars. I love the detailing around the neck here. And then we got this one, which goes this way. And you know, it has like the little hem there, which is really adorable. Y'all gonna see a lot of stripes from me this spring and summer. I'm into stripes, child, for some reason. I don't know. I'm just feeling stripes this year. So I was at Nordstrom Rack and I purchased this um, shirt here. And it's a little big, but you have to see it on. It don't really look like all that big on. My daughter liked it and told me to get it and I picked it up. And I like the color. Next up is from Rachel Zoe. Um, I got this from Marshalls and this is another striped shirt that is really cute on. I thought this shirt would be cute with some high-waisted pants. Next up we have here, don't y'all laugh, but I have, a, and I'm gonna let you see the jacket first. It has the um, rose gold zipper here. This is the front of the jacket. This is the back. It's a three-quarter sleeve jacket. And this is actually by Ivanka, Ivanka Trump. Ivanka Trump. I know, girl, but when I tried this jacket on, I liked it. This jacket. And I said, you know what? I'm going to buy this jacket. And then on the inside here, we have just a red, white, and blue stripes, once again, shirt that is really cute. And actually, I tried this on together, and it went it went really, really cute together. I got these two from Burlington. Next from Marshalls are these two shirts here. These are definitely going to be in my color capsule um i love these colors these colors are just my jam you know so this is a jones of new york shirt that i got on well i got a good deal for it for um twenty dollars at marshall's which is a really good price then i got this one this is called rose and olive and snake skin girl i'm telling i don't know but hey is this season for you, girl? I don't know. Maybe I'm getting old instead of a cool girl. You know what I'm saying? These are what I consider some basic shirts. So I got this shirt here before. I really thought about my counts and what colors I wanted to put in. But this is a really cute spring shirt that's from Carmen. I like the sleeves on it. Nothing that serious, but I have an idea about this shirt here. Um, and here I have two basic tees, um, but they're a little bit better quality they're from Cynthia um, Rowley and then another shirt by Jones in New York which is stripes once again but these are black and white stripes I'm gonna show y'all how I'm gonna wear these stripes girl this year y'all just keep on watching and check your girl out up next are some sweaters that I got from Macy's y'all I love this sweater here but it is huge on me and I went off the measurements um however I don't know that I'm gonna actually be able to keep this because when I say huge, it is huge. And I was kind of wondering, could I, this is why, this is by, um, it's a New York collection. And let me show you the best part though. Check out these sleeves. Oh my goodness, I am a stickler for sleeves. And I almost wanna keep this because of the sleeves and 
I, I don't know, because maybe with some leggings or something like that, it's pretty big. But maybe with some leggings and a jacket, it might work. I don't know. It has like a little slit there, a little bit of hollow situation. But these sleeves, I want to keep this just because of the sleeves. But like I said, it is huge. It is huge. So, I don't know. I hadn't decided yet with this sweater. I don't know why these sweaters are big, but they are. I got extra large. And this is by Alfani, Alfini, Alfani, I think it is. Um, but look at the detailing. This is my color. This is my jam. This is my color. It has the bows on the sleeves. It has a slit in the sleeve. And I love this sweater, but girl, look at there. It has the draw, the um, rouging right there. They are gorgeous, but they are huge. I don't. Then I also got it in this color. This is my color too. But I'm thinking, you know, sweaters sometimes can be a little bit larger. So I'm thinking if I keep these, then maybe just like putting a jacket or some sort over it. I would have to make sure that I have like a, so a pair of leggings and maybe um, these big sweaters might work. I don't know yet, we'll see. Um, I actually purchased these shoes from, where did I get these from? Oh yeah, Nordstrom Rack. And I just like the color on these, to be honest. This was, this is by Natural Soup. But they are very, very comfortable. And I love the colors on these. So yeah, this is a Michael Kors belt that I picked up um, from Marshalls. It has like the little gold detailing right there. It has the gold buckle. I really love this color. I'm really beginning to like this blush color where I never really was into this color, but I don't know, after the, the winter months and I decorated with blush color everything, I just like this color blush. Okay, girl, are you ready for these shoes here? These shoes, I'm going, I, I like these shoes. I got some shoes from DSW. I purchased these shoes. I freaking love the color. However, these shoes are just not comfortable. I tried it on and I just, I'm, I'm really not feeling it. I think it's really cute because it comes up, you know, behind the ankle like this. So, um, I, I, I think though that I'm going to take them back because they're not comfortable. And girl, I don't know what it is, but I just don't like these shoes. When I, I don't think I'm going to keep them because... I just felt like my feet were sliding all over the place, to be honest. And it didn't feel really secure for some reason in this shoe. You hate returning items to the store. I hate returning items to the store. Seriously, like with a pen. I just hate. I don't know why. I hate returning stuff. Next up, we have a pair of shoes by, who is this by? The, which is the same brand. That I just had these these this brand is called Zola. No, this name is called Zola. These are Kaylee's. Oh, Journey Collection. Is it JB or JC? I think it says JC. But this is a Journey Collection shoes. So the other ones were Kaylee. This one is Zola. Now on the website, this shoe looks burgundy. Look what color it is, but girl, it is hot. Tootie does not like this shoe. I love this shoe. I think it is so cute and it is so different. I think I'm definitely going to keep this, but check. You see the color on this, right? Like I said, it was like a real deep, look like burgundy. So when I got it and saw this color red, I was like, oh no. And let me tell you why I said, oh no. Better yet, let me show you why I said, oh no. Because... These are by, these are the Journey Collection. Who are some other shoes by? I don't know who them other shoes are by. I thought they were the same people, but I guess they're not. This is by the Journey Collection. And what's the name of these shoes? These shoes are called Kedzy. Now, let me tell you something. Check out this shoe. This shoe is so cute. I put it on my foot. I was like, oh my goodness, I love, love, love this shoe. This is the problem I had. <sighs> They're the same freaking color. 
So I don't know if I should keep them or if I should return them. I love the style of both shoes. I was thinking about returning them for a different color, but I I really like the red one and this one. I like the red one and this one. And I can't really say it go with my color scheme. <laughs> I'm gonna get my colors together. That's what I better do. Cause as of right now, don't nothing go with these red shoes, but I like these red shoes, right? So I'm thinking, which one should I keep? I'm not gonna return them until you guys tell me which one I should keep with the red. I'm going to probably exchange them for a different color, but which red one should I keep? Should I keep what I'm gonna call this one. Should I keep A or B? A or B? So just tell me in the comment section below, keep A or keep B, whichever one I should keep. Um, because I do love both of them, they're just the same color and I don't, I don't know that I need two pair of red shoes to be honest, but I'm looking at that color scheme over there, girl. These ain't gonna work. <laughs> So let me know what your thoughts are. Anywho, that wraps up this haul here. Like I said, I I have two pair of black pants and probably about 10 pair of jeans that I bought from Tory. Um, but I needed to do it. I really just needed, to, and what I did was, because I used to have like all Old Navy jeans. Well, I don't like the way they fit anymore. So I got rid of every pair of Old Navy jeans, which I probably got rid of about 15 pair of jeans. Plus some other jeans. I honestly totally in all in general got rid of about 25 pair of jeans. So I had to replace my jeans. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna do just a haul of torrid jeans. I might and try them on for you because they, you know, they do fit differently. So we'll see. I don't know. But anyway, remember to tell me which shoes should I keep? A or B? A or B? A or B. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel. If you have not subbed yet, hit the sub button, hang out with your girl. So you can see how I rock these clothes, how I put them together, how I pair them together, all that good old stuff. Hang out with your girl. Come back and see you, girl. All right? Bye, girl.